Tzerach, Ecclesiasticus 10. A wise judge will instruct his people, and the government of a prudent man is well ordered. As the judge of the people is himself, so are his officers. And what manner of man the ruler of the city is, such are all they that dwell therein. An unwise king destroys his people, but through the prudence of them which are in authority, the city shall be inhabited. The power of the earth is in the hand of Yahuwah, and in due time he will set over it one that is profitable. In the hand of Elohim is the prosperity of man, and upon the person of the scribe shall he lay his honor. Bear not your hatred to your neighbor for every wrong, and do nothing at all by injurious practices. Pride is hateful before Elohim and man, and by both does one commit iniquity. Because of unrighteous dealings, injuries, and riches got by deceit, the kingdom is translated from one people to another. Why is earth and ashes proud? There is not a more wicked thing than a covetous man, for such one sets his own soul to sail, because while he lives he casts away his bowels. The physician cuts off a long disease, and he that is today a king tomorrow shall die. For when a man is dead, he shall inherit creeping things, beasts, and worms. The beginning of pride is when one departs from Elohim, and his heart is turned away from his Maker. For pride is the beginning of sin, and he that has it shall pour out abomination. And therefore Yahuwah brought upon them strange calamities and overthrew them utterly. Yahuwah has cast down the thrones of proud princes and set up the meek in their stead. Yahuwah has plucked up the roots of the proud nations and planted the lowly in their place. Yahuwah overthrew countries of the heathen and destroyed them to the foundations of the earth. He took some of them away and destroyed them and has made their memorial to cease from the earth. Pride was not made for men, nor furious anger for them that are born of a woman. They that fear Yahuwah are a sure seed and they that love him, an honorable plant. They that regard not the Torah are a dishonorable seed. They that transgress the commandments are a deceivable seed. Among brethren, he that is chief is honorable. So are they that fear Yahweh in his eyes. The fear of Yahweh goes before the obtaining of authority. But roughness and pride is the losing thereof. Whether he be rich, noble, or poor, the glory is the fear of Yahuwah. It is not meet to despise the poor man that has understanding. Neither is it convenient to magnify a sinful man. Great men and judges and potentiates shall be honored, yet is there none of them greater than he that fears Yahuwah. Unto the servant that is wise shall they that are free do service, and he that has knowledge will not grudge when he is reformed. Be not otherwise in doing your business, and boast not yourself in the time of your distress. Better is he that labors and abounds in all things than he that boasts himself and wants bread. My son, 
Glorify your soul in meekness and give it honor according to the dignity thereof. Who will justify him that sins against his own soul? And who will honor him that dishonors his own life? The poor man is honored for his skill and the rich man is honored for his riches. He that is honored in poverty, how much more in riches? And he that is dishonorable in riches, how much more in poverty?